The Tampa Bay area race community dealing with the loss of a legend overnight. Dave Steele died while competing at the DeSoto Sorry, Speedway in Bradenton. Too, Jake Peterson spoke to those who saw the crash. He was running probably over 100 miles an hour. DeSoto Speedway maintenance man Jack Briggs was watching Dave Steele go for the win. He was a uh, top-notch spring car driver. When all of a sudden Steele's left front wheel hit the back of another car, causing Steele's car to go airborne and spin 180 degrees. Briggs says he didn't know what to think when it first happened. It really didn't look that bad, you know what I mean? It, well, the way it happened, you know what I mean? It was, it was just like everything happened just in slow motion. It really didn't tear up his car that much. But minutes later, Briggs and the 2,000 people in attendance knew something was wrong. I kind of give me the heebie-jeebies. It was just a, a freak accident, you know what I mean? It, it can happen, you know, in stock cars. Paramedics at the Speedway treated Steele, but his injuries were too severe. The crash happening in front of his family. I hope the family will, uh, will be all okay. I hope they don't give up on racing. Steele was a racing legend. He spent more than 20 years on these tracks, and he even spent some time driving NASCAR. Many of Steele's fellow drivers knew he was going for his 100th win in Florida. Last night when he came in the, uh, to get his pace way in down, joking around, I said, well, you're going to win tonight. And he said, well, I'm going to give her my best shot. And now this community is missing a legend and his family missing a father. I heard he had a uh, young son. I hope that uh, he really remembers his dad. Reporting in Bradenton, Jake Peterson, ABC Action News. No.